welcome everyone to this new edition for not exactly a tutorial but general recommendations for this global problem that we have right now such as the coronavirus pandemia now past around two or three weeks people did not want to really take the adequate notifications and recommendations to be aware of this um, sickness and governments around the world have been trying to contain this virus spreading amongst people by you know telling them to stay home so this video basically is to tell you three things number one this virus is not to be taken lightly there are some other reasons I cannot tell you in this channel but it is not just a single low form virus this thing is very lethal because um, I don't want to affirmate some things but you should really be taking your time and making your own research about what is really going on behind this spreading virus but the thing here is that please be safe please stay with your family I know some of your family members will not uh, want to stay voluntarily at home try to make him understand that this thing is irreversible in some cases at the worst major adults um, to be understood elderly people are not as much as um, with a strong immune system as you may probably be you may probably give a a positive in, in the coronavirus test uh, but if you're young and you're you know you're keeping your health under check uh, eating regularly uh, at your times uh, sleeping well you know taking in dose of fruits that will help you to uh, combat this this illness then you're kind of okay if you're getting uh, medical treatment but some elderly people are not that lucky and they are not self-aware that they are the most vulnerable in this moment the second thing I wanted to add to all of this is that um, Blender for so long has been a very pillar to the medical research area. Being an open source software, Blender has contributed to the dental odontologist uh, area in a big time. They do print 3D pieces for some of the dental operations. They do like, you know, the, the usual thing you go to the dentist too. Well, they use Blender in sometimes for some cases. Uh, also, the medical brain research also has been taking advantage of uh, simulation on how to create operations inside the brain, ocular nerves, and things like that. This is the example that I'm presenting here to you uh, because it's really important that to explain medical, medical issues or medical procedures, Blender is also doing its best to represent appropriate methods to to create such medical interventions all right so i've been invited to some of the projects to represent this kind of uh, procedures medical procedures and in the past i've had the chance to also create other things such as internal organs and the way i usually approach this is by creating general shapes and then going into sculpt mode for example the internal parts of the stomach right here I create them and then I, I did a, um, a boolean operation to create the hollow parts and also I like to go with the skin modifier and extrude points sub subdivision surface and then continue um, sculpting so you can see the result here for a deceased stomach um, intestine and this time you can you know take your advantages uh, around food around keeping your body healthy and last but not least this is just a shader test that I was doing so I wanted to keep this short thank you so much for listening to this video every time you share you make this channel grow so thank you very much for subscribing